Hello guys, this is Jones1095 with another LEGO video for you today, my last planned one for the foreseeable future. This is of my working brick shooter LEGO crossbow. A lot of people always say, like on my M14 or 870 videos, why didn't you make a brick shooter? So, I just kind of needed a brick shooter in my collection, so I made this a while back. I actually don't remember when I made it, but I made it. A decent amount of time ago and it's it's really simple it looks pretty cool it's just a mini crossbow and it shoots as I told you it's a very simple operation you simply pull the rubber band back put it on this and now it's cocked and you just pull the trigger and it shoots it shoots really hard really fast um, like 70 feet is the range of it and it shoots these or these little things All right. right there. How it works is, um, well you see this piece, all you need is this, it's, uh, just on an axle, and you need two pieces, a three stud long, even though it's not a studded piece, um, kind of an NXT piece and then another one of these. It's hard to explain without showing you. But I think you can get the gist of what these are. It's really, really simple. And then this is optional. I just added this in. It's really simple. Actually, this is what you need for the trigger. You need one of these and then another one of these that's only three p uh, three studs long. Like I already said, it's not a studded piece though. So what you do is when it cocks, it uh, pushes this forward, so now it's laying on the trigger, and it won't move unless you pull the trigger. So when you pull the trigger, it goes like that, and then it releases the rubber band. And this, all it does is stop it from spinning freely, and it jams, so I'll show you. See, with this on, it stops this from moving. I'll show you. So it didn't spin that time. This time it will, because I'm going to disengage this. It just stops it from doing that, because sometime it would actually jam, and it would get stuck, like, right there, and it wouldn't work out. I'd have to manually, like, reset it, and I didn't want that to happen anymore, so I put this there. So this is extremely simple. You can use it in, like, any anything you want. I just have mine in a crossbow configuration right now, and this right here... All it does is holds my ammo down so I can shoot this upside down. So, see, that's all it does. It's really simple. It just, everything is controlled with your thumb and your pointer finger, apart from cocking it. You just press your thumb up and you put the round in or whatever you want to shoot. Take it out, whatever, pull the trigger, reload it, do the same thing, and that's it. And these are all smooth pieces. You can launch whatever out of here. I just chose to launch this. I just want a small projectile so it goes as, as fast and as high velocity as possible. So I'll shoot it now. So cocking it, really simple. Just do that. And then you will slide your piece in. <laughs> you got hard that hit. Then you pull another one off. You can go through paper, only one sheet of paper, uh, not through cardboard or two sheets of paper or anything more than that. But you can see they go pretty fast and far. I'm not going to do like a range test of this. But you can shoot these guys or my other pieces of ammo right here. They go a little bit faster, not as accurate, but the gray pieces aren't really accurate anyways. Huh. And the way I have this fastened on the front is with these two pieces, the rubber band I'm talking about. Uh, it has to be really tough to withstand everything. And then these right here um, just stop the rubber band from going like there. And then every time I shoot it, I have to 
do that, and then pull it back. It just stops it from going anywhere. And by the way, for the trigger mechanism, this is the other piece I was talking about that's three studs long, so it's just a combination of this piece, which is the part that touches this, and then there is this gray piece right there, just one of those. So if you can see that, how the mechanism works. And now I will show you some slow motion of it shooting. I wonder if you frame. Ooh. Get the Lego cruiser. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the water bin. <laughs> that That's so sound. cool. Oh, I'm going to put that in the video if we caught that. Oh, oh. it's sweet. Yeah. <laughs>